Hello everyone, this is Nick with CoopCritics.com and today I am here with a redstone quick tip. Uh, and in this quick tip I'm going to show you how to make a hidden bookcase. Let's say I want to go enchant some items. I've got my pickaxe here. It looks like the highest enchantment I can get is level 8. That's just not going to do it for me. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to step on this pressure plate and then boom, all of my bookcases appear. I can drop my pickaxe in there, get my level 30. Ooh, efficiency four and unbreaking three. Once I step off, they all disappear. So let's learn how to build it. We're gonna start with a nine by nine platform. First thing I'm gonna do is find the center point, which is right here. I'm gonna place two blocks and then my enchantment table. That way I know that is the center. I'm gonna place one block out on all sides of that. This will be the empty space between the bookshelves and the enchantment table. Wherever I want my entrance to be, I'm going to start placing sticky pistons one block over from that. So I want my interest to be right here, so I'm going to start placing sticky pistons right here. They're going to go all the way around the outside of this uh, wooden planks that we've put down. And for this to be hidden, I must, I must say that you have to use oak wood planks because the top of the bookshelves matches the oak wood planks, and that's what keeps this hidden. I'm going to place those down on top of all the sticky pistons. Then I'm going to place repeaters. I'm going to skip the first one, and you'll see why later. I'm going to place a repeater here, here. I'm going to skip this one because we've already got a repeater going into that piston. One, two, three, four. And these back three, one, two, three. And then the same thing over here, one, two, three, four. Now I'm going to run redstone from this point right here. We're going to put an oak plank right there because this is where our pressure plate's going to be. I'm going to put redstone there, all the way out to this outer edge. Come all the way out here. We're going to place a repeater there. Redstone, 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 redstone. Then we're going to come back over here and place redstone around here. Repeater again there. And then redstone down this line. Then we're going to extend the redstone, put one more repeater, and then get these last three connected. Now I'm going to finish out the top floor by placing oak wood planks all the way around. Now when I step on the pressure plate you'll see that they come up but they don't come up in that wave pattern that they were before. So to fix that we're going to mess with the repeaters a little bit. So these first two are powered by the redstone, so they'll be at zero ticks already. So we're going to set this one to two ticks, this one to two ticks, these two outer ones to three ticks. Leave this one set to zero tick, or one tick, two ticks, three ticks, four ticks. This one's going to be four ticks. One tick, two ticks, oops, one tick. Then over here, this one's set to three ticks, one tick, two ticks, three ticks, four ticks. Now, I hope that's not too confusing, but what that's going to do is that's going to allow it to be a wave pattern, which looks way cooler. If you'd like to see more redstone quick tips, please leave a like. If you have any questions or any suggestions for future quick tips, please leave a comment below. And as always, for more videos like this in the future, subscribe. I'll see you next time. There's two blocks already duplicated. Three blocks already duplicated. We started out with 12 blocks. We have 16 right now.